Hey folks, Amy the Potter, uh, making bottles right now. And what I wanna do is show you how one way of bringing the base in at the end. So let's see, we're gonna take some chances. It may or may not work, but it is a way if you realize at the end, you, you usually wanna do this at the beginning is make the base the diameter that you want it to be, but sometimes at the end you take a look at it and feel like, hmm, I really wish that had a bit of a more narrow bottom to give the pot more lift. So that's what I'm gonna be attempting to do here. So main thing with bottles is to leave enough clay everywhere. I wanna leave enough clay at the top, especially, that's the place where we tend to thin it out for a little extra height there. Leave enough clay at the bottom so we don't thin it out and then have to keep coming back and babying the bottom. And leave enough clay in the middle if we're gonna be belly the pot out. I'm keeping the top relatively narrow. Okay, so I don't wanna narrow it too much because I wanna have this opportunity. And then also, very important to uh, not use too much water in a bottle. So here, let's go ahead and leave it like that. Um, I'm gonna bring it out. And then just gently swoop it back in. Okay. Bring it out. Gently back in. Normally I would use a footer here, but because we're gonna practice this technique, I'm not gonna use my footer. Hopefully I'll be able to do it at the end. I've got my wet hands, and I'm gonna wait for it to feel ready for me to do my move. One hand collars, one hand pull, uh, one hand pulls, yeah, throws. Okay, and then going back with some precision to make the shape of the neck that I want. Okay. Do my magic rib and give it the shape. pretty good to me. And now, here we go. I've got this hard metal rib. I'm gonna stick a finger inside. I'm spinning the wheel pretty fast and I'm gonna lift up with this inside finger just slightly as I dig under a little bit more. I think that that made a difference. Yeah. Should go a little bit further just for fun. At some point, I'm just compressing the clay down there and it doesn't like it, so it's starting to jump. So we'll say that's enough. <laughs> I'll undercut it here since I can't get my footer under there anymore. And go back just with my magic rib to smooth out some of these problems if I can. Lifting, lifting, lifting with this inside hand, my left hand. Sorry if my head's in the way. And then one more time, I'm gonna need to clean this up from, from doing having my hand inside doing that lifting. Lifting kind of helps the pot come up. And that's it. Um, I just love making bottles.